Engine lubrication is another way of saying engine protection. All motor engines have a large number of moving parts, all contained within a metal jacket, which, when partially removed, enables us to see what is happening. At the top of the engine is the camshaft, which opens the valves, and the springs that close them. Below that is the block, containing the combustion chambers and cylinders, with the pistons rising and falling within them. The movement of the pistons is transmitted to the crankshaft by connecting rods secured by the big end bearings. Below all this, there is the sump to store the oil, a pump to force the oil to all areas needing it, and a filter to keep the oil free of solid particles. All the parts moving are metal and must be kept apart from one another if destructive wear is not to take place. By using a transparent model engine, we can see how the oil forms a protective barrier between the parts through channels drilled in the crankshaft. By oil splashing onto the cylinder walls. And by tubes to get oil up to lubricate the camshaft the cams and the valves. Although the oil film is very thin, it effectively keeps the metal parts from contact with each other. This engine is turning very slowly, but at normal engine speed, it would be running at about a hundred times as fast. So without lubrication, severe wear and seizure would take place very quickly. This cylinder lining is badly scored. And this piston has certainly seen better days, as has this main bearing. And other parts, all irreparably damaged through lack of lubrication. It is oil delivered by the pump to all parts that prevents such expensive failures. By using ultraviolet light and adding fluorescent material to the oil, the channels through the crankshaft are clearly visible, as is the flow around the camshaft. Modern multigrade oils have added to them a finely balanced group of chemicals to reduce sludge formation and inhibit the creation of acids and other harmful compounds produced during the burning of the fuel. And while circulating, the oil not only cleans the parts, but also has a considerable cooling effect. A further bonus of multigrade oil is its ability to behave like a thin oil in cold weather and to retain its viscosity in conditions of tropical heat. Multigrade oil will continue its protective function whether in stop-start motoring or motorway conditions of continuous high speed, provided that clean oil is kept flowing to all moving parts. Smooth running and a long engine life can be achieved by ensuring that the filter is changed or cleaned according to type and that the oil is changed at regular intervals. Good lubrication helps any engine to give of its best over long periods of time and under all sorts of climatic and driving conditions.